Good morning, everybody, and welcome to the Lashing Daily Briefing for Sunday, the 6th of October, 2024. So then the synoptic situation uh, as of midnight last night, um, that high pressure that has been holding these frontal systems off is starting to disappear now for the northeast. So these so these frontal systems are going to start to get a grip with the weather in the local area, certainly in the next two or three days. Um, so this is at midnight last night. So I've run that through to midday today. You can see we're underneath an uh, occlusion um, with a cold front behind a sort of a warm sector-ish low cloud uh, type uh, situation uh, with southerly winds at the moment. So there's no real change from tomorrow uh, just yet. Uh, but obviously this low pressure that's out uh, in the Atlantic now is is going to take over and certainly be uh, quite an influence over the next couple of days. Uh, spot winds are giving us today winds at 2,000 feet of uh, 1,620 knots, uh, further south uh, 210, uh, 20. Uh, and I just put this little windy chart up to see that low pressure that's whizzing its way around on its way to us. But down here, notice this, this hurricane uh, is actually on its way as well. And if I can actually play the uh, tracker for that hurricane, you'll see its route is actually going north and then east. And actually is going to run to the south of us. Um, this low pressure here, funnily enough, is going to keep that away from us. But only today at the moment, actual winds at Lashamar pretty well uh, 11 knots straight down runway 16 at the moment. So the clouds, we're going to be basically covered in cloud all day here. Uh, there's no frontal systems per se over us throughout the, the daylight hours, but we've got this cold front coming up uh, to the west and we've got the residue of a uh, an occlusion uh, out to the to the east and we're sort of stuck in the middle in this very uh, moist uh, uh, sector uh, rain you can see there's quite a lot of rain around although it's not raining here at the moment the Southampton they've got 800 foot cloud base and rain there and that's basically coming our way and we're going to be stuck in this situation pretty well for the day I predict uh, if we run through the rain forecast, so this is the actual forecast. It does a funny jump in a minute if I just show you. So this is uh, around about now. You can see that rain at Southampton as it slowly uh, perks its way up. Uh, so this is now 8.30, but very shortly it does this funny jump. I'm not quite sure why it does that. The weather just disappears. Um, and then we've got a larger wadge of rain, but that's actually indicating it can stay clear of us throughout the day and dry out. So um, to say I'm slightly confused would be an understatement, uh, but we do have uh, more rain after that jump here for around about 12 o'clock onwards. So I'm, I'm just not quite sure what's happening between that little jump there in 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 the weather situation but anyway it's going to be wet uh and low clouds uh locally they're saying overcast pretty well all day they've got drizzle for one o'clock here uh winds south southeastly similar to yesterday 10 knots with gusts of 22 knots uh, on the surface for a while and then abating as the day goes on but with wind going more around to the south probably as that uh, front uh, comes through GFS is giving us max temperatures today of 14 degrees with a dew point down at 10. And when uh, the view outside the window at the moment is you can see this cloud getting thicker and thicker coming up from the south. And uh, if I run through the actual temperature at the moment, just over 12 degrees, dew point at nine and a half. And you see the temperature and dew point remaining fairly flat have done for the last uh, nine hours or so. Uh, Odium is giving us nine knots from the east southeast, uh, visibility 10k or more. Uh, their TAF it is not usable at weekends. Uh, Farnborough is similar, seven knots from the east southeast. I've just, just high lit the second half of this really. So uh, from 10 o'clock till one o'clock, uh, local wind 10 knots from the south, broken clouds at a height of a thousand feet. Temporarily between 11 and 4 o'clock local, 6k vis, broken clouds at 600 feet, light rain and drizzle, with a 30% probability temporarily between 12 o'clock and 4 o'clock today, 3,000 metres, broken cloud at 300 feet and drizzle. Top Metro, clearly no cross-country flying today, but I've run through the significant weather. So this now is as uh, of uh, nine o'clock this morning. We're obviously just down here 
and uh, this in the in the drier part but it doesn't take very long really for this uh, moisture and mist and low cloud to take over so this is 11 o'clock today and then from about uh, 11 on we've got this rain fairly persistent uh, throughout the day so the issue we got at the moment is it's dry but it's not going to stay dry too long and then it's going to rain or it's going to be stuck in for the day uh, so it's whether or not we make the most of the first couple of hours uh, Sky Sight is giving us basically a spot forecast, point forecast today of cloud, very low all day. They, they're saying about a thousand foot, which is perfectly okay for winching, I guess. Um, but overcast throughout the day, uh, winds uh, 160, 10 knots with gusts of 20. So similar to yesterday, no soil conditions per se. And the low terms then, we've got uh, the usual Barton Stacey live firing, Uphaven telephone change at 24. Uh, 25 is Black Bush's fireworks tonight. 28 is Otmore live firing. And if anyone's interested, I'm supposed to do some parachuting down at Paul uh, later on today. So then uh, let's look at, this is the uh, cross-section that Odium presented for the day, and I think it's probably going to be about right. So in other words, we've got a bit of a window now up till about 11 o'clock, uh, then it's going to be right down on the deck, probably for three or four hours, and then possibly clearing a little bit later. Uh, they're giving a 140, 160 wind, 16 gusting 20, uh, low cloud and a thunderstorm risk for later on. You see the thunderstorms this afternoon. All not very encouraging. Uh, so just to add to that, we the jet that should have come in yes evening is going to come in today at about 10.23, it's saying. It's a 7.37. Uh, so basically, we've got an occlusion sat over South England, warm sector type weather, lowest cloud base and occasional rain may be prolonged at times. Cloud base may make 1,500 feet. Uh, wind south southeast on the surface, gusts of 22 and if we fly, it'll be on runway 16 like it was yesterday. Very impressed, actually, with the amount of gliders we had out yesterday, how we did manage 16. Uh, lack of buggies was always the issue, but we did very well, I thought, considering. OK, we've got 4K to Wayne ones and 3K 13s available, two on the booking list with Chris Harrison and Dave Williams. Uh, Four SH2 and 775 are Boeing. They arrived all safe and sound yesterday. So let's hope they get some flying in the next uh, couple of weeks. Uh, all available single seaters are free. And remaining K13 and K21s are also available. I've cancelled uh, the trial flying for today. Uh, there's a booking list. Chris Harrison's full all day. Uh, Dave Williams has got a couple of people, but I suspect the uh, simulator is going to be used more than anything today. OK, uh, runway set up if we do go out and that needs to be that decision needs to be made early because once the rain comes in, we will not be flying for the rest of the day. So um, if there's enthusiasm to get out and get out, you know, some launch in, in the next couple of hours, then we need to do it now, really. So it'll be a standard one six operation, winch down the bottom, cables up the side of the runway to the launch point. Uh, there won't be any air toes today. And so we'll be setting up. Uh, circuits to the left and into the field okay i'll leave it up to you guys i'm not pushing one way or the other if there's uh, enthusiasm to go and do a few launches i suggest we do it now uh, otherwise i'll see you around and about today bye bye